for the grand prize of $20,000. Hey, I have a Donnie FL moderator on my FX Impact M3. The close one goes out then. Connor. Este Taipan en calibre 22, el cual tiene un aftermarket shroud. Shooters, you have 20 minutes. Just reaching out to everybody, um, giving so much. Fire! So this is just a shorter version of, of this. This, this is a longer, longer barrel. Hi, I'm so and so shooting for so and so team yada yada. This is my blah 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 signing off. AEAC is made possible by Air Venturi, Hawk Optics, Diana Air Guns, FX Air Guns, Day State, Air Arms, Sports Match Rings UK, HN Sport, Aztec Optics, and JSB Predator Pellets. And you guys know the best way to thank them. Hey guys, I'm Nick Gregoris. I shoot for Air Arms and American Air Gunner, and I'm so excited to be here at Armag and to talk about my favorite gun with you. This is my Air Arms S510, but I've tricked it out a little bit, did a little barrel prep, and I've hot rotted it, so I'm shooting about 55 foot pounds. I'm shooting the HM Barracudas, which is kind of an odd choice, but they shoot awesome. And I'm shooting the HM 28 grain slugs all out of the same gun. This is my go-to, this is my do-it-all. This is the one that I sleep with. This is this is really my favorite platform. And if you can't tell, I'm really jazzed to be shooting for air arms and to be out here at Armac. Wind kicked up so damn hard, and right. I played it. I played it smart. Right. But if that wind wouldn't have been up, I wouldn't have made those points up. Yeah. They've just been target practice. I got you. Everybody's guns as good as everybody's guns. These are all. No one out here is shooting a two MOE at a hundred yard gun. No one. So when that wind came up, I was celebrating big time. Like, okay, I, I think I got a strategy for this. And now 
How's it guys? My name is Gerard. I'm from the channel Air Hunter Gerard. In the stage at the moment at the Rocky Mountain Air Gun Challenge and I'm setting up my big ball gun for this challenge and it's going to be awesome shooting a Texan for the first time and uh, lobbing some big big pieces of lead down range. Um, super fun. I don't really get a chance to shoot these big guns back home because we only allowed to shoot 22 and this year I thought to myself you know just for fun shoot it try it and this is what I'll make is about just having fun all over the show like I said very very nice hey I'm Troy from Cincinnati Ohio I'm shooting the crawl bighorn this is my Mulan edition it's a custom built it's got a double bottle adapter it's a 27 inch TJ hammer forge 30 caliber barrel a solid well not solid but a steel tension barrel system uh, set up in a, it's got a swan harmonic tuner Donny FL Ronin on the end shooting an Accutech bipod set up shooting the 4475 JSBs at 935 feet per second this is a vector optics minotaur scope it is a fixed power 46 zoom. I mean, I was given like a brief little, you should totally go get it. Okay. It's going to make you feel great. Your joints are going to be great. Your skin's going to be great. But what, what's like... I would say pay attention to that, but yeah. also keep in mind it's a it's a natural supplement. So frequency and consistency. Just like a workout routine. Yes. I'm like, where are these lines? Three samples. Oh, yeah, sure. Uh, what, you can give me two eights? Hey, I'm Jean. I'm uh, shooting for my own team. <laughs> shooting my, uh, of course, our uh, uh, slugs. I'm shooting 25 caliber, 37 grains at 980. And I'm having Impact M3 with Cyber Tactical Bag Rider and Titan uh, Element Optics. Acutac Bipod, it's hardcore thing. I made some uh, special. Um, how do you say it? It's a um, barricade stop or yeah, barricade stop. I don't use moderator because of the short, uh, I want to have a short rifle. So the transitions between the stages, I mean, within the stage is easier. And yeah, that's it. I have my own custom built bag. <laughs> that's it, goodbye, see you. Hey everybody, I'm Tom Adams from Tomcat Air Guns. This is my uh, Day State Red Wolf. I call it the Blue Wolf, obvious reasons. And uh, yeah, down here at uh, Rocky Mountain Air Gun Challenge, having a great time shooting the slugs and the, uh, oh, what is this, Precision Marksman event. And uh, yeah, I think I'm shooting right around 1,000 feet per second. It's pretty hot. Um, yeah, got the zero DP moderator, my little wind flag here, and uh, oh, polygonal barrel, hawk scope. This is a new Sidewinder with a little window in the back. I really love that. Akatak bipod, of course. Um, yeah, and then Crawford and Lipped buttstock right here. And I've also got a modified handle right there uh, for speed shooting. Uh, yeah, 
doing pretty good. She's told on the left side of it for the win. Your position right there. Do you know where your first target is? Uh, right along the, le the yeah. left side over there. Okay, that'll be your first one. Okay, gun and mag in hand. Okay, you ready? Um, uh, yeah. Okay, spotter ready? Shooter ready? Mm -hmm. Engage. Ten seconds. Line is ready. Shooters. And by fire. Hi, I'm Cecil from Hot Sun USA out of Springdale, Arkansas. Um, this, what I'm shooting today is the Hot Sun Factor RC. This is our new competition gun. Uh, we just started shipping it in 2022. I'm shooting it in 22 caliber. Um, I've got a saber tactical rail with a AccuTac bipod on it. I'm um, running a Donny FL and uh, got a Hawk scope on it. Um, these are all just pretty much stuff that I've used on other guns. And just moved it over to this gun. They work well. Um, this is my third time shooting the Armac. I'm really happy to be out here. Utah did a great job setting it up. They always do a good job and a great event um, and great competitors out here. Um, yeah, we just love doing it. We uh, hopefully we'll do good this year. Wow. Two mils of push right now, guys. Two mils of this wind push right now. Insane. That's insane. And then 267 is the UA. Okay. Right to the right of the Because the one that you back to go so we have, but they will. Here we go. No, I mean, I'm, I'm excited. Here's the question. Who thinks Nick is going to win? Yeah! Who's got their money on Giles? Giles, are you ready? <laughs> Nick, are you ready? Go see his ready. Get over there. Come on, Giles. Let's go to the What's happening guys? I'm Tun Jones for Air Force Air Guns, shooting for Air Force and RAW. This is my 457 Texan, shooting a 350 grain boat tail hollow point, running 800 feet per second. It's bad. I got everything on here. I actually have my buddies borrowing my AccuTac bipod, so the Gagas is shooting with that in my AccuTac bag. But I have my Ergo grip, my zero angle grip on there, and this is our new trigger guard. It's a beast. It just came off the course. How was it? Did you know all that went? It was unique. <laughs> no, I, I did better than I thought, but the wind was shooting enough. I've hit three of the target posts. Not the target, the post, which still means miss. Time for some of our newcomers. What ranges, uh, what yardages are you shooting at? 290, uh, I think was our, no, 296 was our longest one. 
and all the way down to 75 and everything in between and you find out right before you shoot the target. <laughs> Thanks, Ty. Appreciate it, man. Thanks, brother. Last ceasefire event for you have wildlife on the range. We'll try to get the mustard off the range. Continue. I've got to talk about weapon safety. Yesterday and the day before, during our practice sessions, we saw too many people being muzzled by weapons coming near out of the box. One in 18 should stabilize everything up to 30 grand. I think it'll go well. Yeah. 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 The one in 24 smooth twist X stabilizes at 30 grand just fine. Okay. It's a one in 24. So, well, yeah, I'll check that out. Yeah. But it's probably better, probably better to err on the far yeah. side. Someone on left, someone on right. Make sure no, one's no one can step in front of these cameras. Austin says put that one right there. What do we got? Stop plate? Okay. Let's move that one there. We're going to start off at 25, big to small. All right, we're going to go out to 75, big to small, and you're at your stop right here. All right, this is the finish. You got 45 seconds, eight rounds in the first mag. Hey, I'm Mike Hansen with Umarex, and I'm shooting with American Air Gunner today. Today we got the Gauntlet 30 caliber. We start off with the Donnie FL at the top. As you guys are checking this out, makes the best ones out there. Running down here on the top, we got topped it with a right on 6x24x50. And I'm shooting 30 caliber, 44 grain pellets. I'm telling you, the wind's hot. You guys have fun shooting lead. I'm Mike Hansen out. Hello, my name is Derek Wall. I'm from Houston, Texas. I uh, shoot for Team Centercut, and this is my Vulcan 3 22 caliber. I'm running a Silent Thunder Ordnance moderator. Uh, I'm shooting a 34 grain varmint knocker at 1,025 feet per second. Hola, ¿cómo están? Mi nombre es Franz Jenin, soy de Chile, eh, del canal Sniper Hunter Chile. En esta oportunidad estoy disparando en el Precision Marksman. Estoy ocupando mi rifle de, de Bench 
por lo que está mucho más difícil porque estoy disparando pellets, no slacks. Eh, estoy usando un Impact M3 en calibre 30. Eh, tengo una mira Element Titan, eh, Suppressor on, Fat Boy de Tony, tipo de Alcutac y algunas piezas que me hacen en Chile en 3D Print, An Ergo Grip, Saber Tactical piezas y eso. Ah, ah, y el rey de ser fantástica nuevo se ve muy muy bueno y está muy entretenido y los dejo invitado a todos los que les deseen venir el próximo año. And a two, and a three. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Justin. Happy birthday to you. Hi, I'm Haley. I'm 15 years old. I'm from Utah, and I shoot for Utah Airguns team. Um, so I use the Sumo silencer and with an AccuTac bipod, only AccuTac, those are my favorites. And then I also have the Titan Element um, scope, Element Optics, which is probably my favorite scope that we own. Um, we got this gripper that my dad just got at Sportsman Warehouse, you know. <laughs> um, we got a Saber Tactical buttstock. And this is from Sabo Tactical 2, the monopod. It's my favorite thing ever. It's all I use. Um, Haley, what's with this Lucky 752 and this, this cool coating you have? Um, this coating is Utah Air Guns since everything. Um, the Lucky 752. I actually, at the last RMAC, I won it in the lost one this gun at the. Um, the raffle and this ticket I actually have the ticket here with me it's the I the last the 752 is the last three numbers of the ticket I won it with so I just named it seven, lucky 752 and it's been its name since so awesome how's it going for you out here this week it's going pretty good yesterday was a couple was pretty rough but today I think for the finals I did I did okay got, yeah so I think I'm doing better still got the speed speed finals to go I think I'm doing all right. Congratulations on making the finals. Thank you. <laughs> Thank Bye. you. Bye. Jesus. Did that wind completely switch? Yeah. Hi, John Bagakis here from California, here in uh, Utah for RMAC. Shoot, I'm shooting for Day State. I've got my Day State Red Wolf and 25 caliber, Athlon Chronoscope, uh, good old Zero DB moderator, and I'm shooting Zan slugs and reaching out to you know 190, 200 yards with these things. 
come out and have some fun if you're not here. Hey, this is Ken Hicks over here at RMAC, getting a little side in here um, from Florida, owner of Southern Precision Air Weapons. So this is this is the gun I'm using for speed silo. It's custom length barrel, got the Sabre tactical rail, the Koi, the barrel, the barrel's only this long. Dual 300 cc's, 25 caliber, shooting the 34s about 850 feet per second. Sweet little gun. My little iguana thumper. Wish you all out here, try and make time, come out next year. You won't regret it. Spotters. Yep, yeah. All right, shooters, are you ready? Ready? Yep. Stand by. Fire. Green. Orange. Green. Orange. Green. Orange. Green. 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 Orange. Green. Shooters, are you ready? Yep. yep. Stand by. Fire. Hi there, my name is John Rupel. I'm out here from Wisconsin, shooting out at RMAC, enjoying this beautiful, beautiful weather. So, uh, what I'm shooting today, wow, I'm shooting 25 caliber, shooting the FX Crown out on the end. I've got a Donnie FL moderator, love Donnie FL. I've got the uh, Donnie FL, no, the FX harmonic tuner on the end of the barrel. Very helpful. You probably hear a little bit of people saying, eh, no, it's helpful. Running an Act Attack bipod. If you came out here, you'd see 95% of the people out here are running these Act Attack bipods. Same thing for the Donnie FL moderators. Uh, running a scope right now, I've got the Element Helix. I'm gonna spend a little more money for next year for optic. My eyes are getting old. I need a little more magnification, a little more clarity. But I tell you what, for a low-end scope, you get a lot for your money with the Element Helix. Uh, Sabre Tactical chassis on here, all under here, all the way across here. Think of it like a bolt-action rifle. It sits right in there. That's how it works. Folding stock. For This makes it really nice for getting it, because as you can see, I have a long air gun here. When it's folded up, it fits in a case a lot nicer. Got a bunch of flexibility for, thank you, got a bunch of flexibility for however long your neck is, however long your arms are. You got a lot going on here. Anyway, uh, I gotta get ready guys. Thank you for your time. Fire. Three. Three, yes. Hi, this is Jeff Cloud from Mansfield, Texas. I'm shooting for Team Air Force and Team Raw. This is my Raw HM1000X in 22 caliber. Shooting pellets today. It's got a Citron 10 to 50 scope on it. It's got a Gray Ops uh, saddlebag here with a Gray Ops uh, Arca rail. And then I got the new Kinetic Security Solutions uh, barrel tuner on it. I got my little wind indicator I use in field target. I use the same rig in extreme field targeting as today. MDT stock down here on the end, fully adjustable, and that's about it. Hey guys, Jeremiah with Right on Optics. I'm, I'm here with Umarex shooting the Gauntlet 2 30 caliber. 30 caliber air gun running about a thousand feet per second. I have the Donnie FL Subo uh, suppressor. Uh, we come down, we have the Right on 7, 4 to 32 by 56. We're rocking and rolling and having fun at RMAC 2022, guys. Go off. 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 Go
Shooters, are you ready? Ready. Stand by. Fire. Hey guys, I'm Boyd and this is Lexi. She just got done shooting the Big Board Challenge. This here is my Air Force Texan. It is chambered in 457. And we got this fancy paint job by my best friend, JLJ Art. We're running uh, Atlas Tall Bipod on this. And other than that, oh, we got a little extra special sauce on the back. This is a little modification we did. Um, with the Sabre Tactical buttstock, we just modified and put that on there. So, what speed and uh, what speed and what slug? Uh, we're running the 350 grain Nielsen, and we're running at a, just about 800 feet per second. Lexi, how was it shooting it all this way? Uh, it's an ass kicker, but it's so much fun. Honestly, I can't get enough of it. Were you able to ring that steel as much as you wanted to? I mean, it's never as much as you want to, but <laughs> <laughs> you know. Awesome. Thanks, guys. Thanks, guys. Thank you. What's up guys, my name is Justin Welch, I'm from Arvin, California. I shoot for Utah Air Guns. Here I have my 22 cal FX Impact 700 shooting 31 grain Nick Nilsons at 1,030 feet per second. And man, this thing is smashing. This thing has a Donnie FL Sumo out on the, Ronin out on the end. It has the new Element Optics Theo, so I've been running this go for about three months, the guys, and it is insane. It's got multiple wins under its belt. I'm super happy with the glass. Um, got that Akitak bipod, you know, keeping everything rock solid so got the Crawford and Lipt new rear kick pad with the integrated bag rider new top rail this thing's rocking how's it going I'm Thane Simmons I'm from Utah I'm um, shooting for team Sabre tactical side shot and Donnie FL uh, this is my rig right here it's a impact m3 I'm shooting 22 cal Nielsen 31.2 grains at about 11 11 feet per second I mean it's cooking um, We've got a new prototype lower rail, uh, upper the TRS rail. You can see I've got a, a band right here to, to help so this thing stays sturdy and doesn't ever move. Um, got a new grip as well. Um, and then also for PRS, we've got a magnet to keep this back so we don't double feed. That's it. Peace out. Great job, man. Okay. okay. You guys all enjoyed free lunch yesterday? Yeah. 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 Okay. Yeah, I did too. Um, well, as you all know, today is the same. You all get free lunch. Everybody who's registered. Thank you. 